craft in its deepest history was, you know, making things that people needed to make. And, um, and most people don't live in a world anymore where they have to make their own pottery or weave their own cloth. And um, what's interesting in North Carolina is that um, a lot of those traditions have continued up to the present but have also evolved in a lot of interesting ways and, and in many ways have just have merged with contemporary art. It is true and you sense it when you're here and you sense it when you travel through people's studios is one that there's an intensity here that doesn't exist everywhere. At the John C. Campbell Folk School we, get, uh, we had over 6,000 people last year who came to the Folk School because they wanted to learn something in the company of other seekers. And they're, uh, you know, every possible profession, every possible kind of background, and they come together around the table and learn how to make a basket, make some jewelry, you know, carve a duck out of wood, whatever. We do host visitors from all over the world. It's amazing. And what visitors most often say is they are amazed that there is something like this in this little town. How can that be? And they're also really, really interested in knowing where they are, who are the people, and how, how, can, we, how can we observe their art and sort of get a better sense of where we are. We have uh, amazing basket makers, ceramic artists, uh, you know, textile workers. Well, uh, Penland is a perfect example of uh, the diversity of mediums that it excels in. And I am thrilled to be a part of that community that exists here because that's really hard to come by in any other part of the world, I think, to be in such an incredible, you know, uh, an incredibly beautiful spot in the mountains with so many artists and craftspeople. There are so many people who come off I-95 and go east to the Outer Banks or uh, in going into Asheville, uh, as well as the state, is, is rich with uh, individual studios, the bookmaker, the printer, um, the, the glass blower, the ceramics, the weaver, the drawing, the painting. So um, it's wonderful that uh, the state is, continues to raise the flag and celebrate um, the, the creative voice that is here.